We're here at the 2016 Los Angeles Auto Show, where Volkswagen's first ever seven passenger crossover makes its auto show debut. Dubbed the Atlas, VW's new anti-minivan will be offered in five trim levels, along with two engine choices, which consist of a standard two liter turbo four that produces 238 horsepower and an optional 280 horsepower 3.6 liter V6. Both engines route power through an eight speed automatic, though only V6 models can be had with all wheel drive. Whether you stick with the bench seat or opt for the captain's chairs, the Atlas's second row slides and reclines and allows for access to the third row with a child seat in place. Speaking of which, the third row, surprisingly roomy. I'm 5'11 and eh, I could see myself sitting back here. In fact, I see myself sitting back here right now and it's quite comfortable. Up front, there's a simple yet elegant dash layout mixed with good and not so good materials. The centerpiece is a new capacitive touchscreen infotainment center with the latest iteration of VW's CarNet connected services, which includes things like Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, and proximity sensing. Whoa. And as you can see, it loves fingerprints. <laughs> the usual adaptive safety systems like dynamic cruise control, park assist, lane departure prevention, and pre-collision braking are all available as is a segment first post collision braking system that applies the brakes after an airbag deployment so as to help reduce the chance of additional damage. The official pricing and fuel economy information for the 2018 Volkswagen Atlas will be made available when it hits dealerships in the spring of 2017. Now, 